Good day, ladies and gentlemen. In today's episode, Mulberry. let's explore the Ghoul Lagoon Sea Caves. You don't say. Squidward bought a new sweater. Oh, we so mow. And there's a golden spatula at the end of this cave. Wow. Okay, cool. So we there's just a need to. Golden spatula at the end of this cave. Mow. Thanks, Gary. Navigate to the golden spatula at the end of this of, of the cave. Um, but um, let's just explore the entrance quickly. So this is a teleport box, and um, who else can we play this level with? Okay, Patrick. Okay, let's switch back to SpongeBob. SpongeBob, although Patrick can pick up stuff, SpongeBob can trigger all of the buttons so generally you do get further with spongebob unless there's something that needs to be picked up by patrick Fresh like a spring breeze. okay that looks nasty <laughs> okay Am I gonna? I doubt I'm gonna make it to the end without getting losing at least one undie. Okay, lost an underwear. Um. All right, so I gotta turn this bridge. Okay, it's a flipping bridge. Oh no! Oh wow! Okay, just psyching myself up. Okay, I think I should start doing this. Doing that in this way. Made it without losing an undie. Okay, let it sink first. Alright. Okay, might as well go this way. Okay, checkpoint that this looks problematic. That spongy does have that double jump. Okay. It still falls in a very peculiar way. <laughs> okay, don't miss, don't miss, don't miss. Okay, cool. Some of these um, 3D game jumps are actually quite difficult to master can easily miss it's still disturbing okay okay that was that was uneventful <laughs> because I guess I always had to go this way Okay, then again, maybe not. Oh, there's a spatula. Okay, cool. Very weird level. Very odd indeed. Okay, there's a tall gate over there. Travel to the Ghoul Lagoon Pier. All right. So there is a pier that we need to explore as well. Okay, that's the exit box.
Okay, looks like I'm going in the right direction. Alright, Mr. Crab. SpongeBob, help me find Patrick. I have a task that I think he can help me with. Okay, Mr. Krabs. Sorry, lad, but the carnival is closed. Oh, no. A pesky robot has taken over me ticket booth. And worse, me money. <laughs> if you help me get rid of that no-good robot, I'll give you a big reward. Okay, Mr. Krabs. Okay, there is a robot making machine close by. Robot duplicator. Oh. There's no getting in there. Okay, let's try it. Okay, maybe we can overdid it. <laughs> okay. Okay, that's left me speechless for a while. <laughs> okay, so I just need to get the shiny stuff on here. Or I could just stand at the bottom and let the shiny stuff come to me. Which works out better. <laughs> Oh, there's an ice cube. Okay, a whole lot of tikis and a duplicating machine. There you go, ham. That works out better. I don't think actually this is actually what I'm supposed to be doing, but <laughs> I think I cheated there. Oh wow! That was an ugly way to get pummeled. Okay, Cup and Sosa. I still like this when I was when I was a kid. That's much better. Okay, that was enough fun. It's kind of Okay, oh, it looked like there was a uh, way into that tent. Okay, I seem to be going the right direction. SpongeBob needs the bubble ball power to play ski ball game. Okay, as far as I know, SpongeBob does not have that power yet.
I I assume that you've got to find Bubble Buddy in every level where there's a new power, and I've not seen him. Oh, oh, oh no! One goes boom, hard as a rock. Okay, I need to be more careful. Uh, as I was saying, my. My theory is that you possibly would find a bubble buddy Ooh, in presents. in levels that you wouldn't expect it to be. I suppose it could be hidden. I'm not sure. That's just my theory as to how to get those um, those powers of SpongeBob's. Because, or well, alternatively, I suppose you would have to clear the game at least once, and then you should have all the powers by the end of the game and the beginning of the next game is a whistle. well something to, something to think about are oh, so many robots uh -huh. Okay, so I know not to go up there. Maybe I should sw uh, swap to SpongeBob. Let's see if we can get further. Just try all the buttons quickly. No, definitely not any, not acquired any hidden talents <laughs> as yet. Okay, let's continue with Patrick for a while. I saw a lot of cubes, so I'm thinking that and and watermelon gonna need Patrick's skills. I will crush them. <laughs> oh no. Oh, there's a duplicator. <laughs> that was smart. That's much better. Okay, but but the the way the way that specialist is just in the air there. I think I'm uh, going to need SpongeBob. It looks like there could be a bungee cord for that one. Okay, trampoline. Smoothies, yummy. <laughs> okay, this looks like a slide. Pretty sparkly thing. Oh, oh. This, this is nice. This is quick. Oh. <laughs> it went boom. <laughs> Okay, I think we'll stick with Patrick for now. Okay, I'll try and stay out of the ticking tickies. Ouch. Oh. I don't think SpongeBob's underwear fits quite right. <laughs> oh, that was short. What is a whistle? Okay, let's explore this. See, there's the spatula, it's like in mid-air. So 
not like we can build walls in the ramps down to it. So there is that trampoline that just got placed there. Oh, that was not a good idea. Definitely not a good idea. <laughs> well, it was worth a try. Okay, let's try that again. Okay, I'm sure I can get up there. Okay, okay, there's... There's the hook. Oh, no. Okay, definitely requires Spongebob. Nobody else can ride the undies. <laughs> Only SpongeBob can. So we're gonna need to use that bungee. So okay, up here. Oh, I I bumped the top. Went too close. Come on. <laughs> okay, I had to double jump there. Okay. Ultimate nice. <laughs> SpongeBob Ooh. actually likes wedges. <laughs> that was funny. Okay, getting down is no problem because he doesn't get any fall damage. Unless we do something silly like that. I, th I thought I was gonna land on the pier. Okay, with Patrick, maybe we can get some of those. Um, those spatula spatulas on the lower deck or beyond the lower deck. Like there's an ice cube over there. So there must be another ice cube Ooh, so that you can get there. And there's a watermelon. Looks like a target on the other side of the pier. Smoothies. Yummy. There's a button. And a bunch of robots. Oh, again, again. oh, I stunned him. I should have checked if I could throw the thing. Would have been interesting. Okay, this is... This is the Patrick toss tossing thing. Oh, there's an ice cube. 
There's another ice cube. I wonder if it's gonna be one of those situations where I can go, but I can't get back. Okay, I gotta wait. There's another ice cube over on that side. Okay, let's go to there. Oh, and it's a spatula. Cool. Oh, th this is the one that's right behind, below the merry-go-round. So I think basically I did get all the spatulas on this level. I think we can go and use that launching thing now. Almost as if that thing could crush you and you could lose all your underpants. Oh, it's gonna be a nuisance. Ooh, a present to everyone. Oh. oh no. Okay, luckily That's there is better. an underpants close by. Bachelor? Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to end the video here. We've explored Goo Lagoo Pier and we've got a spatula from completing the mission there. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and do join me in the next episode of SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Take care. Bye bye for now.